someone's rosary. These beads have been worn away almost to nothing. Scene. Must be another way. Who are you people? All that can come later. If you want answers, then listen close. We've managed to destroy the old radio tower, but there are repeaters that keep them connected. We need to shut them down. Help me, and I'll let the others know they can trust you. We need all the allies we can get. I'll keep an eye out for them. Good. We don't have much time.
I've infiltrated the ranks of the enemy and learned that they come seeking the rich resources of the mountain. They appear to know nothing of the secret we protect. Those who build the Iron Road are themselves prisoners, slaves of the Red Army. Massive machines now use the Iron Road, bringing more slaves, food, and raw materials for construction of a small city. It is time for me to return to my people so we might plan our attack. If we can inflict heavy losses upon them before they reach the mountain, they may give up and turn back. Have you done it? Are the transmitters destroyed? I haven't found them all yet, but I will. We were fools, careless, arrogant fools. We thought we could stop them, but the Red Army outnumbers us. Their weapons are superior, and they just keep coming. Many of my people, including myself, have been captured, forced to work the mines of our own mountain. It's only a matter of time before they discover our secret. When this happens, we must be ready. Prisoner. Maybe I can find him.
Damien, the Prophet's Forge. Cities are not built on plans alone. There must be material, and there must be someone who knows how to build. Damien was that man. They say he could muster brick from nothing more than a handful of dirt and a tinderbox. They say his craftsmanship was divinely inspired. It is his hand that gave form to the architect's dreams. after the source. I should find out what they know.
Maybe there's a way to get up to the old prison. Markings point to a nearby location, but I can't quite piece it together. Definitely Russian. It looks like these markings point to a nearby location, but I can't quite piece it together. abandoned in a hurry. Did the Soviets find something down there? The Prophet was persecuted, and so were his followers. Water down below. Sounds like a great volume. A coin with an image of a city stamped in gold. And there's the prophet. This was likely an official coin of Katesh. Ugh! <sighs> 
icon cast in gold. The metal workers of the city started to develop their own style, but it's still similar to Byzantine craftwork. got to be part of the works. eroding everything. At this rate, there won't be much left in a few decades. levels change. My love, this letter is long overdue. But I have been hard at work. When you arrive, there will be a home for you here with all the comforts we have left behind. It is a huge task ahead of us, 
to design and supervise the construction necessary to provide fresh water to our people. But all my labor will be paid in full when I see you and our children's faces again. We will create a new world here, the equal of everything you left behind to follow me. It will not have been in vain, as long as you and I are together. should be more than enough oil to light the passages below, but be careful transporting it. We have not perfected the refining process and it is still volatile. You will know the man who supervises the construction. We all do. Without his knowledge of the earth, none of us would have survived along the difficult journey. Do not linger. And if he asks for word of his wife and child, feign ignorance. He cannot accept that they perished during our exodus and expects them to arrive any day. We need his genius, and I fear if he saw the truth, we might lose him entirely. Maybe I can get the oil cast from the other side.
It worked. Gifts of the Earth. 